Hello, Matthew Williams here with a quick video to say my anus is bleeding. My anus is bleeding. If you've ever had hemorrhoids, you'll know what I mean. Um, if you don't like gory stuff, turn off now. Um, I am going to be talking about some gory stuff. It's going to get pretty gory and it isn't going to be, there isn't not, not going to be any useful information in this video to do with anything normal apart from gore shit. So anyway, right, um, this is what you get on a daily basis. These are my, um, yeah, see, blood on my thermals. Uh, that's what you get if you get fucking hemorrhoids and they get changed regularly, but it still comes back. Um, every time you go to take a crap, um, you irritate the hemorrhoids. So they start bleeding again. Anyway, um, irritation, hemorrhoids. I've got various creams, Anusol with um, blah, blah, bloody um, lidocaine in it. But this wasn't doing much good. Um, I've had these hemorrhoids now for a week since I had the Novo virus. And um, basically what happened was hemorrhoid on the surface of the outside of my uh, anus. Um, I can't believe I'm doing anus news. Anus news 2016. All the best anus tips. Um, so yeah, I got this fucking thing. And uh, anyway, it sort of it was just like a little lump and then it split open and then it sort of grew it grew up into it almost like like a penis it was literally like a penis it was like this sort of thing hanging off and it had like an eye and i and i was look you know held a mirror down there to see what was going on and it literally looked like it had a fucking eye in it and i was just literally waiting waiting and waiting for it to go like this and start looking around like you know that those fucking movies where people have rings that kind of like you know and they sort of whoop, open up and there's like a little eye in there and it's like looking around i was expecting this to happen luckily that didn't happen but um what did happen is something came out of that so out of this fucking thing that sort of you know just went and popped out right then something <laughs> went and popped out of that fucking hell so anyway, this extra appendage that uh, grew out of that, um, I don't know how best to describe this really, um, you know, it's like a sort of hot doggy type sort of thing. You know, like, um, I don't know if any of you have ever owned any male dogs, um, if they were to get any sort of like, you know, stiffy, um, it just ends up looking like horrible and veiny. Um, well, that kind of looks like that. Um, but instead of being pink, um, which, you know, uh, you would imagine it should be, it's black. So something wasn't right, for sure. And you, like, touch it, and it's, like, hard. And, you know, I tried pushing it back in. I tried to try to push it back into its own hole, you know, and it sort of just sort of wouldn't really go in. Uh, the first couple of times I tried to push it back in, it went in, and then it sort of came out, and then it went stiff and wouldn't go back in again. So it's like, oh, for fuck's sake, what is this? What is this? So um went to see the doctor today, and turns out um, uh, it's congealed blood. It has clotted, and um, that will not be going back in. In fact, it will be continuing to turn black as it is dying, and it will... Uh, fall off at some point um great anus news 2016 um yeah so i got these things and it says one to be inserted in the rectum daily hmm some of us enjoy that sort of thing <laughs> so i've got all these suppositories now and these are hydrocortisone cortisone hydrocortisone uh, suppositories and they've also got um, painkiller in them because this is a bit painful and I've also got some uh, I've got some of this stuff Xyloproct Proct Proct because anything proctological it means up your arse so um, yeah and this stuff is also painkilling you know, so I've got a thing. Look, look, special thing to shove it right up your fucking arse. But, um, you know, the problems aren't on the inside. 
Um, but anyway, these are to um, basically loosen up my stools so that I am shitting really soft for the next week. Because apparently, if you didn't know this, um, you shouldn't really bear down, according to many sources. You shouldn't bear down when you're trying to have a shit. You shouldn't sort of go and squeeze, which, you know, uh, yeah, you have to, because otherwise you'd be sitting there for like a fucking hour waiting for shit to naturally drop at, at gravity gravity pace out of your own arse, which isn't going to happen. So, um, anyway, of course, administering creams to one's arse is, is shit. So I got I got these things finger cots. I have got I have got um, latex gloves. I've got, you know I've had, I've had these for ages. I've got a big box of latex gloves. But of course, who wants to waste a whole latex glove just to use one finger's worth? So I got these finger cots, which are like finger condoms, which is like down 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 down. Get that right up your ring. Do 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 and move around inside your ring, yeah. So yeah, that's what I've um, got. You know, could be useful for the girlfriend maybe. You know, if fucking got some sort of dermatological condition perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, yeah, life is um, uh, li quite literally shit at the moment. Um, <sighs> With uh, with all that going on, and looking like I've got a fucking uh, um, a, 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 a dead dog's dangly hanging out of my um, already uh, piled anal passage. So um, yeah, well, thanks very much for listening and uh, looking at disgusting things like my underwear with all blood on it, and it is blood. I can assure you, it does not smell. Well. It would be too late now if it did anyway, wouldn't it? Because I just smelt it. So, anyway, there we go. That's what it's like to have... Uh, I was going to say AIDS then. <laughs> that's what it's like to have piles. <laughs> no, that's not what it's like to have AIDS. Um, that's what it's like to have piles. So, uh, hopefully I won't have them too long. So, get it on!